the success of Pfizer's clinical research unit not only involves the people behind the scenes, the staff, the doctors, the researchers, but anybody that walks through the front door who's willing to volunteer their time to help someone else. I'm John. I've been involved in numerous studies for about 11 years. Atopical dermatitis, diabetes studies, various types of cancer studies. Probably if you name it, I've done a study for it. <laughs> I'm willing to come here to help out total strangers and hopefully that makes a difference. It's amazing how far they've come, what they've done over all these years and what they've created. What keeps people coming back here, what keeps people engaged here is the hope that it's going to help people. No day is exactly the same, no study is exactly the same. We've both been here at the research unit for about uh, 11 years now. The first time that I was working in the clinic, it was John's first study as a participant. You ever think about how many patients, their families, their friends, you know, how much that impact you've had? Yeah, a lot of times whenever I see a commercial come on, I always wonder if that was one of the studies that I was involved in with that drug. Yeah. Definitely gives me a sense of accomplishment, you know, that can't be measured. It's a lot deeper than just showing up and doing your time in here and coming out. You have an emotional stake in it. While it may feel like our individual day-to-day -day actions are small, collectively, they have great impact. We're here to save lives. We're doing the work. I work on the clinic floor. Um, I collect data, as in doing ECGs and vitals, drawing blood, and we administer the study drugs to the participants that come in. What we do is unique. You know, we're faster than many of the other options, so every minute that we're able to save those add up to the patient who is on the waiting end. Maybe it's not working, maybe they need another option. So if we're able to speed that up at least a little bit through our work, that helps more people. Bar not, this is the best run place I've gone to of all the research facilities. It just runs like a well-oiled machine. You know, they're, like I said, the staff is top notch. They're professional. They're courteous, they're kind. It's always a great experience being here. I tell friends and family that it's not what they think it is. It's like a hospital slash hotel. You have hospital equipment and you have a nice little hotel room. And you end up becoming friends with these total strangers that you meet in here. Whether it's playing pool or doing a four day Monopoly <laughs> marathon like we did one time. Community. You meet all different people from all around and they have all these amazing stories. I'm very friendly with the participants. It's just, I just enjoy being around them. They make you feel like they want you here. They come here so often and I feel like the people who work here are family. Every medication that has gone to market has involved thousands upon thousands of participants. The ripple of the impact of one participant is so much greater than themselves. You know, I have a lot of respect for them, a lot of admiration for them. We absolutely couldn't do it without them. Well, my father just always said, do your best, whatever I did. Hearing my kids tell me that they're proud that their father goes and does something like that, that's gratifying. A lot of progress happens in science in 20 years, and I think we've very much been a part of that progress. I keep a lot of hope in my heart that one day all these treatments are going to be able to eradicate some of these problems. I'll continue to come here as long as I can. <laughs>